Hello everyone, welcome back to the video. So, in this video, we are going to learn how we can create a tooltip in Power BI. So, first of all, let us see what is a tooltip. The tooltip is basically the information that we see after hovering on a certain data point. So, as you can see here in this in this chart, when I'm hovering on this west region, I am getting this tooltip. I'm getting this detail of sum of sales is uh, which is displayed and the region name. Similarly, for different data points, we are getting the respective data. So what if I want some additional data? Means, for example, for this data, I'm having a, a subcategory in the table. So if I'm hovering on a specific subcategory, I should get how many customers have ordered from this sub specific subcategory and what was the order distribution based on the region so for example in east region in west region central and south region what were the sales respectively so for that we will have to create another page for tooltip so let's see how we can create that so here first of all what we have to do is enable the tooltip allow use as tooltip so that we can do in formatting the formatting page option under page information, we can check turn on the allow use as tooltip. So what it does is automatically resize the page, but no need to worry. We can also resize the page according to our wish. We can do custom. We can uh, resize the page according to our wish, whatever size we want. That basically, this is the default size, uh, size provided by Power BI. So we can add some visuals over here. We can add a pie chart based on region and sales. So I've already created two tool tips for both the visuals on the report page. So this is the first tool tip. Here we are getting the information about total customers who have ordered the product from that specific subcategory and the total quantity sold along with the distribution of the sales based on the region and another tooltip I have created for total customers and total uh, I think this is total profit let me change the heading for this okay and here we are getting the information of sales by ship mode first class second class third class and same day So let's see how we can add those created tool tips uh, in this visual. So there is basically a setting for that. We just have to go to format your visual. Under general, we can see a tooltip option. So what happens now it is on. So what will happen if I turn it off? So as you can see previously, I was able to see some information when I was hovering on the table, the subcategory names. So I will on it. And now it is enabled. So this is the by default tooltip which is there. And now I will add the tooltips which I have created. So uh, we, uh, in the options we are having type which will be report page. And the page which we have created will be the tooltip one. So I will select tooltip one. Okay. So that's it. It's done now. Now if we will hover on this. You see. We are getting this information about the total customers, the total quantity sold and the sales by region. So this is for that specific subcategory only. So you can see it is changing and I'm going to different subcategories. So this is how it works for this visual. Also, we will add the tooltip. So another tooltip which I have created is tooltip 2. Here also, if I will hover on this, I will get this information about total customers, total profit made and the sales by different ship modes. It is also changing based on the regions I'm hovering to. So that's how basically a tooltip works. And that's how we create a tooltip in Power BI. I hope you have got the general overview of what tooltip is, how to create a tooltip in Power BI. So thank you very much for watching the video. See you in the next one.